President Biden on his way to Europe for a summit of world leaders. Aid for Ukraine at the top of the agenda. Senior White House correspondent Selena Wang is in Bari, Italy. Good morning, Selena. Hey, good morning to you, George. President Biden is making his way to meet with U.S. allies at a summit here in Italy. And as you say, at the top of the agenda is Ukraine. The White House says the U.S. and their allies are preparing to announce a new plan that could deliver massive resources to Ukraine. According to a source, this new plan could provide some $50 billion in new loans to Ukraine by using profits from frozen Russian assets. So this is a solution that would be using Russian funds instead of taxpayer dollars to help Ukraine. Now, the U.S. argues that this would also send a powerful message to Russia's Vladimir Putin that he's not going to outlast American and global support for Ukraine. At this summit, the leaders are going to be hashing out all of those tricky legal and financial details for this plan. They're hoping to finalize it by the end of this week. The U.S. is also going to be announcing new sanctions on Russia that would make it harder to finance its war machine. Now, Ukrainian President Zelensky, he is going to be coming here to Italy in person to meet with President Biden. They'll be holding a joint press conference to tomorrow, and Ukrainian President Zelensky Zelensky, he's going to be driving home the support that his country needs on the battlefield. Robin. All right, Selena, thanks so much for your reporting.